Alcohol does the opposite. So when you take Ambien with alcohol, you get no sleep. And, and in fact, that's what I saw when I sent the SEALs in to get sleep studies. And again, they weren't complaining about sleep. <laughs> they, like this was just life. It's like, hey, I can't, I, I wake up at four, I can't go back to sleep. I just come in and work and work out and try to get tired that day and go home and go to sleep earlier that night. You know, they've been doing it for five years, hasn't worked yet, but their SEALs, they're going to keep putting their head down and running harder and figuring out how to do it better. Um, and so, uh, you know, I, I said, well, you know, every single symptom, like I didn't think every single symptom would resolve, but I thought every single symptom they have could be correlated to this poor sleep thing. I'd have them do, I'd have them do sleep studies. Their sleep studies came back 99.9% .9 stage two sleep. So wow. no deep sleep, no REM sleep. Now, y'all, y'all have been practiced long enough to know how much BS there is in the medical literature, but you know, academics would tell you that those guys would die, right? They, they can't, you can't survive that. You can't survive that way. Yes. They've been doing it for, you know, five, 10 years. So it's like, you can survive. I don't know how, but you can. Um, and so, you know, I finally, you know, I, I talked to a bunch of, I mean, by the time I kind of figured out what, what I thought was going on, I'd, I probably already had a hundred, 150 guys depending on me to help them. And so I said, well, I really think the sleep is going to be a big component of it. Right. Um, and yeah, you know, there's a ton of resistance to that, you know, cause sleep is for I'm the sure. week. You get sleep, sleep, you sleep when you're dead. Oh, I don't like that. It's kind of like trying to tell a runner not to run. Right. Something like that. <laughs> right. <Yeah. laughs> and, uh, yeah. And so I, I, I talked them into trying and of course I couldn't just, you know, take their ambient away and say, suck it up. You know, I had to give them something else. And so I went to like very traditional things like <clears throat> Co Cochrane database, you know, uh, PubMed stuff. And I was like, what, what supplements have been proven to help with sleep? And then I was learning a lot about sleep and what happens when you sleep. So I could figure out why you're, why those supplements work. It makes sense. 